The artist Michelangelo once said that inside every block of marble dwells a beautiful statue. And that you just have to chisel away to find the work of art that is within it. And I want you to imagine for a moment, if you apply this to leadership, that instead of discipline and pointing out everything that's not getting done right, that you focus on getting rid instead of everything that's in the way of an employee being the best that they can be. Literally chiseling away at those barriers. You not only transform the person you are chiseling away at, but you transform yourself as a leader as well. Because it certainly feels a lot better to bring bringing out the best in somebody instead of telling them everything they're not. And I've read about um, this concept in a, a few different versions of it over the years. And I just love it because it uh, really helps us to bring out the best in people. And so one way is to treat everyone you meet with a confidence level of 10. So what does that mean? It means literally thinking like they have a post-it note stuck to their head right there on their forehead, stuck to them saying, treat me like a 10. And here's the important part. You actually then treat them that way. You treat them as if they are the best that they possibly can be, that they're a VIP. Make them feel that they are the most important person to you. So why would you do that? Because when you expect the best of someone, they rise to the occasion. Because whether you realize it or not, you send off little cues, and I did this all the time when I was a leader, we send off little cues that say to someone, you've got this, or I don't really trust you, or I don't really believe on it, I believe in you. And so when you send that message and you chisel away at that marvel, when you treat them like a 10, they reach even higher expectations than they thought was po were possible or that you thought were possible. They wind up overperforming because they believe they can because you're treating them that way. You help them to see what's possible when they probably didn't even see it within themselves. You tell someone that, you let them know it, not during a one-time performance evalu evaluation once a year, but all the time you're sending that message, I believe in you. By the way, you can even practice this at home and I love stuff that you can practice at work and at home because anything you practice at home makes you better at it when you're at work. So it might be your family. It might be the waitress at your favorite restaurant. Uh, it might even be that annoying guy that has 25 items in his basket in the express lane at the supermarket. Put a confidence level of 10 on all of their heads. And what you're gonna find is as you focus on that statue within, that marble, that you're not creating an unrealistic un expectation but really creating a beautiful world of possibility for that person. So try it. And then I want you to join me for my next video, which is gonna be all about recognizing the greatness in you because there's a beautiful statue waiting to come out in you as well. Thanks for joining me.